Hello class, uh, my name is Ibrahima Diallo. So today I'm here presenting my calm research paper uh, for this semester. So I choose to talk about women and how society have a high expectation on them. Uh, and I'm gonna talk about how that is related with a uh, cultivation theory. Uh, because I think that's something like uh, my generation or the girls are struggling a lot right now. So I decided to talk about it. So imagine waking up every day uh, like we do, watching TV, big stream, all social media platform, Instagram, Twitter, newspaper, uh, the magazine, and see how social media uh, uh, are portraying them like badly doing a bad representation on them uh, by showing like uh, the way they live like those influencers like uh, the way their body looks uh, because uh, the audience that are watching those reality TV show they gonna think like uh, they should look like that and or that's the perfect example of how women should look like so which basically uh, connect with the cultivation theory because the cultivation theory is like uh, basically uh, making people believe what they seeing is reality which is not because like uh, but the but the young people that are watching the tv they don't know so they think like uh, what they show on tv is like a good thing so they believe uh, what they see uh, and society just hold a high expectation on them and those expectations like uh, most of the time uh, have a bad Im impact on them uh, with their mental health and uh, it get them so stressed about like how they look like they be ashamed or about how they look um, and uh, most of them feeling so insecure about their body uh, and it create confusion on those young girls cause like uh, they don't know like uh, what's real or not so if you show them something that is, they see on the big screen every day, they're going to believe like what they watching every day, that's what they're supposed to look like. And that's what uh, the issue came from. Uh, the reason why I choose this topic is uh, because I think this is a really big deal in society right now. And I see where this is going with my generation. And uh, I don't think uh, social media or, or society is playing fair by exposing them. Uh, Cause uh, people should uh, feel free like to live how they wanna live. Like society or social media should not have high standard on them and put pressure on how they look or how they supposed to live. Uh, and this create like just a lot of stress uh, on them and I just feel like some people that don't have the honey uh, to get uh, plastic surgery they're gonna feel ashamed on how they look and that's like a really big deal so according to this cultivation theory uh, by uh, uh, Enric and uh, partner in 2022 uh, when they show on how social media uh, platform are contributing a poor representation uh, on them on the TV show for example the Kim Car the Kardashian family is a great example of uh, this topic because people are watching those people on like the reality TV show when they show how they live in their daily life. 
So everybody trying to live that way, think like they are the best example of American family and which is not real. At the end of the day, that's like a TV show. And this matter to me because uh, I see where is this going and there is already some young girl feeling ashamed about their body and the way they look. And uh, all he all had to do with uh, watching this influencer uh, on those reality TV show, social media, as Instagram, Twitter, yeah. Uh, this research paper helped me realize that social media is now of like one of the greatest invention in our generation. Uh, but sometimes it can shape you as a person or ruin your life. Uh, and this cultivation theory about how society and social media have high expectation on this female, uh, I think uh, tell the whole story. And I feel like social media is supposed to be a platform that connect people together, but not, not creating confusion or like uh, make them believe something that is not. Thank you so much.